Hey, what's up guys? Today I'm unboxing a bike helmet. It's called the ILM Adult Bike Helmet in matte black. First of all, look at this smashed up box. It's like they, they ran over it or something. Hopefully my bike helmet, maybe it's to display how, how much the bike helmet can withstand, but Goodness. All right. Oh. Okay. ILM. Nice branding. Oh, it looks like the inner box is messed up too. Corner damage there. Inspired to live more. Hopefully, the box was an inspired to live more because it's pretty beat up. But nice little box here. I don't know. I have no clue what it stands for. Here it is. ILM cycling helmet, matte black. Model E3. Dash 10 I have no clue what that means. Weight 360 grams. Brackets plus minus 50 grams. Large XL. I got a big head. Hopefully it fits. So I got an Amazon. It's called the ILM Adult Bike Helmet. Black. Well, it's matte black. Actual large. Okay. I mean. Bike helmets, okay. It came with a visor, so I'm just worried about the visor being scratched up. Pop these open. There it is. Alright. Visor feels okay. matted out light light's an awesome function look at that gradient strobe Let's see that again okay you got solid some crazy strobe Pulsing gradient strobe and off. Oh, yeah, I just love the shape of this helmet. This reminds me of a, a hockey helmet. Alright, so here's the helmet with the stickers all removed. Beautiful helmet. You guys are on the fence about this helmet. Pick it up because this is. This has to be the coolest looking helmet. I liked it because it almost looks like a hockey helmet. The way it shapes down and is contoured in the back of the head. And that visor is just an added bonus. Because uh, I ride my e-bike a lot. And uh, there's nothing worse than getting hit in the face with a pine cone or leaves. And this just helps so much. That's why I got the, the additional clear visor. Because I ride a lot at night too. And uh, sometimes the smoke lens is too hard to see. So you could flip it up easily and ride no guard. But I still get pelted in the head with leaves and pine cones at night. So that added benefit of having that eye protection is worth it. Super easy to come off. You just pull these, twist these with your hand. Probably the simplest mechanism I've ever seen on a bike helmet. My other bike helmet has the three prong button system, but 
once those get wet, they start to rust. And I've had a few break out on me. I love this design. Super sleek. Matte black finish. Matted out ILM logo. Washable pads. Adjustable back. And this chin padding is so soft. And it's perfect right out the box. No adjusting. Quick release snap. Love that. And uh, it comes with the, the little card here. I don't know what this is. Bunch of warning. Owner's manual. Pretty straightforward. And the light is USB mic. Oh, it's a C. That's new. The reviews on Amazon said it was a micro, so love that. That's a C. This is going to charge up in seconds. Nice thick cable here. So it's got a USB mail A to C. Crazy. So what this does is you just plug it into the back here. This better be a C. Oh, it's a C. Yeah, they did not say it's a USB C. I'm pretty sure it said micro. This must be an updated version. Yep, yeah, it's right in there. Charge it up. But it comes with some charge out the box. Nice press seam here. So to activate the lights, the lights activate the front light too. So first is nothing in the back white light in the front second button red solid third is pulsating fourth is the gradient strobe which i love I use that a lot at night and was that fourth? Fourth or fifth press is nothing. But uh, yeah, let's try this on the head. Yeah, guys, look at this helmet on head. It's got to be the coolest helmet. Super sleek design. Super comfy. Chin strap is nicely padded. One hand flip up, looking like Tony Hawk here. It's just, I mean, you gotta look, you gotta be comfortable with how a helmet looks, otherwise you're not gonna wear it. So I just hate those, those UFO style helmets. This one is just super sleek. You don't feel embarrassed to wear it. I mean, it is certified in Europe and I think it's CSA, maybe not, but I love the smoke visor, good visibility. It's going to swap it out for the clear visor now. So here it is with the, the clear visor, which is uh, what I'm probably going to be using with the most. I write a lot in, in night and... You know, sometimes you just want to have that that clear view. What I like to do is wear some glasses, sunglasses under it. I got some Ray-Ban aviators on there, and then put it down. So you got you got the uh, 
sun blocking action and face protection but super cool helmet i said it was csa approved it doesn't have the sticker it's fcc and cpsa compliant i have no idea what those compliance are but it does have good foam protection on there it says it's not for motorsport use so it's not a motorcycle helmet but but if you're riding an e-scooter or just an e-bike going about 32 kilometers 40 kilometers max this is perfect airflow lights visor and looks get this helmet